Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot. I'm here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And this is for the second half of November. So, November 15th through the 30th. One more card, please. What do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? There it is. November 15th through the 30th. So what do we have for Leo? Ego. Eagle. Not ego. Eagle. <laughs> Triumph over troubles, obstacles. Grasshopper, situations in the balance that require careful handling. Tankard, celebration, fun, enjoyment. Oh, it looks good. So far, so good. You will need to, I mean, if you think about a grasshopper, you always got to think about, if you think about a grasshopper, they always got to look, you know, they got to look around, they got to be careful, you know, they could get crushed at any moment. You know, they got to be careful with their surroundings, so you may need to be careful. Um, there is some situation that will require careful handling, but you will be successful. You're going to be able to handle it just fine, whatever it is. You're going to be celebrating your success by the looks of things. What do we have for Leo? Oh, Seven of Swords reversed. Well, that's usually getting caught, you know, something being revealed. Usually, right? Um, there's a need to find a new approach. Some sort of scheming with the Seven of Swords reversed. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Something not working out. Chariot moving. Um, getting in the driver's seat. They're taking a journey. Willpower. Determination to succeed. So there's something going on here. Okay. Then you're going to need to find your determination and your willpower to succeed. Eight of Pentacles reverse is not putting in much effort. Now you may be dealing with somebody that's not putting in much effort. Could go vice versa. This Seven of Swords reversed is uh, running away when the when the going gets tough. Jumping ship, you know. Um, this is this is. Uh, ignoring advice as well somebody may be ignoring some advice you could somebody may be ignoring you um, seven of swords reversed now that is getting caught something happening somebody's gonna get caught not working not putting in effort uh, something is going to be revealed hmm. I don't know if you're dealing with a cancer you could be, you may or may not be, but it feels like you're going to be going in a different direction. You're going to be moving forward. You're going to be taking charge of a situation. Maybe you're turning your back on somebody. Um, but that Seven of Swords reverse, that's that's need to let go, need to find a new approach. There could be some unworkable plan here. And you need to find your ability, your, your determination, your willpower, your inner strength to master your emotions and, and deal with opposition. So you are probably going to be dealing with some opposition in these two weeks. This is an unworkable plan. So it is. So it's interesting. <laughs> but this is leads to success. This is finding the strength and the and the willpower to succeed. Very, very determined. A lot of self discipline here. Going within to come up with a plan. This is this is realizing your your true identity. So I feel like these these two weeks you will be withdrawing. You'll be withdrawing perhaps from the world 
and planning your next move. Maybe you've been, uh, so this could be self-deception. You know, this is some sort of plan that hasn't worked out. Somebody may have been deceiving themselves. You know, that's a real thing. Anyhow, this is a need to go within, a need to withdraw from others. You need time alone to plan your next move. Completely go within. It's a time of enlightenment. It's a time of gaining wisdom. Moving towards higher knowledge. So I think that you guys are gaining some sort of knowledge this week. You're definitely headed in the right direction, but there's some sort of unworkable plan here that you need to let go of. You need to come up with plan B. Okay, another plan. Okay, that's that's the truth here. It's not going to be easy. There's going to that's why there's there's a situation in the balance that requires careful handling. You're going to have to take charge. You're going to have to come up with another plan. That's what this is. That's why there's obstacles here. There is. You're going to be victorious, but there's going to be an obstacle in the way that requires you to rethink your plans. Okay, so you're going to be rethinking plans this in these two weeks. Because something isn't working out. Could be at your job, could be at in a relationship. I don't know if there's been some deception, there's been some cheating. Somebody may be deciding to go their own way, to retreat, you know. The chariot is about, uh, it's also moving, packing up and leaving. Somebody could be leaving. Ne needing a lot of willpower. Somebody needs willpower to go their own way, to, to focus on themselves. So you can you do that, Leo? Can you really just focus on yourself and not let other people in? Six of Cups. Six of Cups is memories, nostalgia. Focusing on the past, thinking about the past. You're going to need to be strong this in these two weeks. For, for some reason, I see that you need to be strong. You're going to need some mental strength. You're going to need to protect yourself. You're going to need to stand your ground. It feels like you're going to be, the people are going to come be coming at you from every direction. Maybe even people from the past. Okay, you may have some people from the past that are, that come a knocking, you know, and you need to protect yourself from those people. Because um, this is protection. You need to stand your ground. Opposition again. So you're going to be dealing with some real opposition. Could be from your children. Um, you're going to be dealing with opposition. You're going to need to think. You're going to need to take time to think about your next move. Um, you know, I really feel like somebody maybe also with that Seven of Swords reverse, something, maybe you are with somebody and it didn't work out and this person is coming back around. You may need to be careful. Whenever you get the Seven of Swords upright or reverse, be careful. You need to double check. You need to really, really, really be careful. This could be dangerous, okay? This is high risk, very high risk. So, um, that seven of wands is, you might need to push somebody away. I mean, it looks like you gotta, you gotta stop somebody in their tracks. You might be able to, you might have to say no. I'm, I'm not that same person, you know? Maybe you've evolved and just, maybe you're a lot wiser. You know, uh, seven of wands. That is like you saying no. That's what I see it as. It's like saying nope. You're going to need to defend yourself, protect yourself in some way. I feel like somebody has been, it's somebody that deceived you. There's somebody that deceived you here, that lied to you, that cheated you, that it didn't work out with. It feels like this person is coming and and I don't know if it's a if who it is. It could be anybody. It's like they're coming they're coming around, you know. Somebody that you know already, obviously. It's somebody that you have some sort of memories with. Now it could be anybody. It doesn't have to be a lover. It's somebody coming back around that, you know, uh 
there's been some sort of deception here with that seven of swords reversed. They're coming back for some reason. Maybe they've become enlightened. You know, maybe they've realized something. Now they're getting in the driver's seat and they're coming in your direction. Somebody is headed. I feel like they're headed towards you. But there's, there's obstacles here. It's seriously. We definitely have some obstacles here. Mm. Five of Pentacles reversed. The star reversed. Why is this happening? Why now? Why, why, why? Why is this happening? You may be asking yourself that question. There's insecurities here. Somebody's insecure. Somebody is, it's like somebody is coming in your direction because it didn't work out. Maybe with, if they cheated or, did, or whatever, something didn't work out. And now, you know, they're, they're struggling. Somebody is struggling. They may be feeling outcast. You know, they're struggling financially or whatnot. Um, or they they were ghosted, or they were they were left out in the cold, and now that and now they're coming, now they're seeing something about you. That's what this is too. That is exactly what this is. Somebody may be asking for your help, you know, and you need to be careful. You know, I understand that you guys are very generous. You need to be careful with who you you give your yourself to. I, feel, I see I see a disgrace here with the five of Pentacles reverse that's a disgrace it's it's a um, unhealthy relationship of some sort but and that star card reverse that's no that's no help that's not gonna be helpful it's not. Why is this happening? This is a test of your faith. Your faith is going to be tested. Something isn't, and I'm not sure if it's a job. It could be a job. It feels like this is, I mean, the star card reverse is, is uh, despair. It is. It's why is this happening? This is why now? Why, why now? It's not, and it's, it's, somebody didn't put in effort, so it didn't work out. It's like now they're coming back or something like that. That seven of swords reversed is, and it's also getting caught. Somebody could get caught doing something on the job. Okay. And they could get, it feels like they could get cast out, whatever that means. Because there could be, there could be a social outcast here with these two cards. But we got that celebration, fun, enjoyment. We have a very wise individual here who has gained a lot of knowledge over time. This person is very wise. This is a Jesus consciousness. So we have a very wise individual here that sees, sees something. Now this is a need to defend yourself. But you're going to be defending yourself this week. Okay? You have, absolutely are. You're going to be defending yourself. And you may be seeing things in a different light as well I think your faith is definitely going to be tested maybe your faith in humanity because this is a card of Aquarius okay and Aquarius is about humanity and it's reversed I feel like your faith in humanity is going to be tested you may have a lot of people uh, talking about you or poking at you or gossiping about you you know People from your past, people from your childhood, you know, and, and I'm not, something is going on. Something is going on here. And I feel like it's like 
you're going to be overwhelmed. I feel like you're going to be overwhelmed by feelings, by emotions these next two weeks. Um, there's some lies. There's some deception. There's, there is. There's, there's, there, there is. There's some lies going on here. That's what that is. That seven of swords reversed. There could even be some illegal activities. We have somebody here that is very two-faced with that seven of swords. And I feel like this person is very controlling because that, that chariot is about, is about control. It is taking control. You're going to need to take control. You're going to need to master your emotions. That's for damn sure. You are absolutely going to need to master your emotions and defend yourself, stand your ground. But don't try not to get angry. Do it with tact. Um, oh, God, it feels like there's there's somebody that is against you. There is definitely somebody that is against you that... Um, this is some sort of social outcast of some sort. Five of Pentacles reversed. But it could be a turning point. But I don't see it as that because the car isn't around it. I need to go within and time out to take, take a break. You're definitely going to need to take a break. Take a break from socializing. Get away from socializing for a minute. You know, because that's it's the socializing that gets you in trouble. Just saying. Go your go go within. Can you do that? I see opposition here. I see opposition. I see trouble. I do. That seven of swords reverse is trouble. And you may be saying, why is this happening? Why is this happening? Because maybe it's time for you to take a break. It's time for you to go within and heal and 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 realize your true identity. Is this really who you are? Are these people who you are? That's the question. You also may be dealing with somebody in a position of authority that has to do with your children. Okay? Because there's children here. Okay, so... Somebody could be arriving to have a conversation about your child. I don't know if there's some theft or stealing or something like that. Or somebody's not working. They can't, they can't work, you know. They can't focus. There's a lack of focus here. Now, what is this Five of Pentacles reversed? Because that could mean many different things. What is this Five of Pentacles reversed? Mmm. Nine of Cups. Now, that's about wish fulfillment, right? That's happiness. Success. Wishes coming true. Realizing dreams. This is... This is... Uh, some sort of acknowledgement. There could be some sort of happiness that is coming. Because this is happiness. This is. This is. Very, very pleased. Very, very, very pleased. Somebody is very, very pleased. Very happy that they have what they have. Very happy with an outcome. Getting what you wanted. So somebody is, and you are going to be successful. So, you know, you may feel, well, if you go within, because that's right above it. So when you go within, to take, take a time out, to think about your next move. Take a step back. Take a step back. You need to take a step back from socializing. Don't let anybody in. Don't go anywhere. Push people away. Just take a step back. You will realize what you want. 
This is being very, very content, realizing what you have, being happy. So you need time. You need, there is time that is needed. You need to take these two weeks to realize what you have. And I think you will be. I do feel like you're going to be celebrating. I think you're going to be having fun. But I think it's with your family. I think maybe this is like Thanksgiving. That's what just came to me. Maybe it's, it's time for you to reconnect with your family. And just focus on your family. You may be traveling. You may be traveling, you know, to visit your family. So anyway, I do see a celebration. I see you having fun. I see you enjoying, enjoying, you know, time. And I don't think it's with friends. I think it's with family. I think you're going to be going through a period of realizing your true identity and what really matters to you. You may be reluctant. Maybe you're reluctant to reconnect with, I don't know, maybe it's your family or whatnot. But my advice is to do so. So anyway, I do see success here. I think it's going to be a successful end of the month, but I do feel like you are going to need to, uh, it's going to, you know, there's a lot that happens in two weeks and we just went over a lot. I do believe that there's going to be somebody around you, maybe from the past, maybe it's a friend, maybe it's a family member, maybe it's an ex or somebody that, you know, abandoned you or something like that. Or didn't take care of you or it didn't work out or whatnot that is really going to test you. They're going to test you. They're going to test your strength, okay? Your strength is absolutely going to be tested. You're going to need to find the willpower and the discipline to keep going in the direction that you've been going. You've been going in the right direction. Do not let this person hold you back. And, there, and I don't know if it's a friend or so, there's. it's not a family member. I don't think it is a family member. I don't know. It could be a child. I don't know. Um, I think there is somebody that is that is hindering your success. Listen to yourself. That's that's what this is. And listen to yourself only. Okay. Listen to yourself. Deep fulfillment is coming. It is. That card wouldn't be here if it wasn't. It's coming. After you defend yourself, after you protect yourself, after you go within to realize. And you have to protect yourself from people <laughs> that are not on your side. But you have to be awake. And this is awakened to see who is and who isn't. So anyway, I feel like at the end of this month, from November 15th through the 30th, you will be going in a new direction. I do see you. It's either you're moving, you're traveling, or you're just, your mindset, you know, is in a different direction. Okay? I feel like you will be traveling in a new direction, however metaphorically that fits with you. I think you're going to be leaving something in the past, okay? Because I go from past to present. You're going to be leaving something in the past, But the main energy here is that Seven of Swords reversed. That is needing to take a new approach. There's an unworkable plan. And you need to not turn a blind eye. Open your eyes. Wake up.
you know, when you get the when you get the uh, knight of or the knight of swords, the seven of swords reversed, that is somebody that is can't face the consequences, can't face the music. Accept. Go within. Find your happiness. I mean, this is happiness. Extreme happiness. Deep fulfillment. So deep fulfillment will come, but you have to you have to protect yourself. There's somebody that you need to protect yourself from. But this is a blind this is like turning a blind eye to the truth, seriously. You know, there could be something here that you're not seeing because you're choosing not to see it and it's hindering your financial stability. You're definitely going to be put in a tough position in these two weeks. And it's not going to be easy at all. You're going to have to find determination, willpower, mental strength, courage to take charge and do things differently. So be prepared for that. You are. You're going to be doing something differently. And you're going to need to think about how you're going to do it. This is something new. You're probably going to say, why? Why do I have to? You have to because it's time. It's time for a change. So anyway, I do feel like you're going to be getting together. I think you're going to be going to some sort of get together. I think it's with family. I do. I think it's with family. I think that you're going to be um, traveling. It feels like traveling. This is taking a journey. Also towards enlightenment, because this is enlightenment. This is an awakening, going through some sort of spiritual awakening. But you can only do that alone. You don't go through a spiritual awakening with people all around you. You don't. So anyway, Leo, I feel like you are going through some sort of awakening. I think that you're going to be taking charge. I think that you're going to be getting organized. I think that you are going to be taking the reins. Um... And I think you need to push some people away that are delaying your own success. Good luck.